Hey everyone, um, welcome to my bathroom again. So today I'm going to try and film this on my ledge. Um, as you can see, there's no screen out my window. And I know this is going to sound really terrible and creepy, but you can totally see into the bathroom across. So I'm actually going to close this a little bit. But I promise I'm not a peeker. But anyway, this is, pro this is actually going to be the very last video that you will be seeing in my apartment because I am moving... Anyway, I have my favorites for you guys, and this is my favorites for these past two months because I forgot my May favorites. Um, so this is May and June favorites, and then from the contest, you guys have said that you know you want to get to know me a little bit better, especially because I don't show my face. And so I thought it'd be fun to kind of stick in you know my favorite things that I did this month at the end of this video, so you'll kind of see like a little vlog going on. So. I'm just going to get right into it because I don't want this to take too long. Um, so the very first thing I've been loving is this Dior palette. And this one is in Earth Reflections. And this is just a beautiful neutral. You're just going to have to ignore my terrible nails, I'm just saying. Um, it's this beautiful neutral palette. It has such beautiful colors, as you can see. They're extremely pigmented. Um, they go on so smoothly. I absolutely have been using this so much this um, these past couple months. The next products are also eye products, and these are the Giorgio Armani Eyes to Kill. Yes, these are very pricey. They come at about $34 per piece, but these are so worth it. There's so much product in it, um, and it's like it almost seems like loose powder that was like shoved in there but the texture of it is amazing. I like to just use my fingers. Can you see how pigmented that is? It's crazy. Let me show you. There's the one swipe. So pigmented and so beautiful. Um, this is in number eight, and it's just such a pretty color. I love it. This is perfect for um, a highlight or for your inner eye area. I like to put this all over my lid as well. It's so pretty. And then the other one that I have is in number six. Um, and number six is so beautiful just as a nice color all over your lid. This is what it looks like. And these are just so pigmented. They almost look like they're wet shadows, but they're not. And I just like to put this lightly all over my eye and it looks so pretty. It looks like nice and smoky. So I've been really loving these. These are so worth it. I think they're, yes, they're pricey, but they are amazing quality and they will last forever. The next product I've been loving, my roommate actually got me for my birthday. She had gotten me a kit and it's the Tarte kit. And this is the Tarte Emphasize. And this I absolutely love. This is kind of like um, a cream pencil kind of thing. Kind of like the NYX Jumbo Pencils. This is such a smooth product and I love using this and you can just blend it out really nicely and then after like 30 seconds or so it's set it like won't move at all so I really like to put this under things you can put this um, just by itself it looks beautiful it's like that perfect bronzy color for the summer the next product that I love is the Bobbi Brown Tinted Moisturizer. I absolutely hate putting things on my face. If you guys know me, I hate putting on foundation. I don't really even like putting on tinted moisturizers because I feel like putting it on, it doesn't even look like there's anything on my face because it doesn't cover anything. So what's the point? So you just shouldn't have anything. This kind of gives that perfect coverage. Um, it gives like it gives pretty good coverage for. A tinted moisturizer yet it feels really nice and cooling on your face it has this almost like menthol feel when I put on my face and um, it really doesn't feel like I have anything on which is what I really love about it so this is what it looks like just like that and you blend it out obviously it's not the color of oh my gosh it's picking up like orange but it's not the color of my hand but it is the color of my face, I promise. And it's just really the nicest balm ever. It's really nice. I absolutely recommend it. If you don't really like foundation, if you like tinted moisturizers, this is a really good one to get. The next two products are really great lip products. And I'm really sorry. I realized just now that all my products are high-end products. But 
Um, this is the Dior lipstick. I've been absolutely loving this color for the daytime. And this is in Tokyo, which is number 422. As you can see, I've used a lot of it. There's, I've used more than half of it. And this is the perfect like pinky peach nude color. These are extremely moisturizing. And they're pretty sheer, but at the same time, they give a good amount of pigment to it which is really nice. I absolutely love this during the daytime to kind of like look really fresh and like pink peach nude kind of color. That didn't make sense, but whatever. I just really hate this packaging. I think it's really big and annoying. Um, and the other one are the Chanel Co Rouge Coco Shines. I absolutely love it. The texture is very similar to this. Um, the only difference is this is a little bit more floral scented. Um, the packaging is so much better. And it, I think the Dior is a little bit more long lasting and hydrating, but this has a little bit more shine and um, is a little more sheer. This color I absolutely adore. This is called Boy and it is, it's going to look very similar, but it's not. This color is way more just pink. It doesn't really have that peach color in it. Um, as you can see, it has way more shine on it and it is a little more sheer absolutely love both of these. Um, I'll show you the difference in color actually. You might be able to tell you can see. So this is way more pink. But I absolutely love both of these. And I just absolutely love the Chanel packaging. I think it's so pretty. Next, if you guys know, I went on a fresh facial kind of thing. And I've been loving my Soy Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. I used to love this in college, but then I stopped washing my face and not caring. Um, but it's so expensive, and this is $38 for 5.1 fluid ounces. But once I picked it up again, I realized I love this so much. And I like this because it's super gentle. It feel, doesn't feel like you're like putting anything harsh on your face. The smell is amazing. It's kind of like a cucumber fresh scent. Um, and it takes off makeup really well. Um, it probably doesn't take off like really waterproof mascara, but that's about it. Everything else comes off real easily and I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna wash all this off. Um, this is what it looks like. Kinda looks really disgusting. It looks like a booger, kinda like a loogie, you know? It's really not beautiful. I'm gonna wash my hands and you'll see. As you can see, makeup completely gone. Not even one drop of makeup on my hand, which is amazing. So I absolutely love this. Besides the fact that it looks like a booger, um, it works just phenomenally. The very last product is the Eden Allure um, Argan Oil. I've actually had this for a while and I really love this kind of Argan Oil product for the winter time because it's so moisturizing. It really sinks in your skin. But then I feel like during the summertime, you know, I don't want to feel like that. Um, and I feel like I almost don't need moisturizer because it's summertime. But you really do. I feel actually extra dry in the summertime. Um, and I've been really loving this product. Uh, I don't really use this in my hair or as much on my skin as I like to use other moisturizing products. But this has been amazing on my feet, especially after, you know, a rough night with flip-flops. Um, after you scrub them, you put this on, put socks on, the next morning your feet feel plump and really awesome. Also, you know how celebrities have like really beautiful shiny legs all the time? Put some of this on your legs and you have that beautiful shine too. It's amazing. Um, and I actually put this product last because I will be holding a giveaway. Um, the company was nice enough to um, want to give away this and a beauty bar to one of my subscribers. Um, but I'm not going to put on my YouTube channel just because I have a giveaway going on right now, which if you didn't enter, go ahead and enter now. I'm going to link that down below. Um, but it's just such an amazing product. I'm going to actually put it on my blog so you guys can go check that out. It'll be easier to just separate all my contests in different places. So definitely go check that out and be amazing. Awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed my favorites products of the month this is a really long video i tried to talk as fast as i could too um and now i'm going to show you guys just some of my favorite things that i did over this last month so i'll talk to you guys soon thank you for watching and don't forget to enter my giveaways both of them both of them 
okay and and next time I see you I will see you in my new um place okay bye <laughs> Felix, what did you get? I got Reuben. Is that a Reuben with some French fries? Yep, Reuben with some French fries. And I got this for um, under Wendy's request. I got the chicken, fried chicken with the mashed potatoes. Hey! So rude. Um, and carrots. This is real. Oh! Okay, I had to eat now because Felix is starting to eat my food. Bye. Hello, everyone. This is Felix and Jessica Lee recording live. The truck fell over on the side. The whole oh truck God. fell. Whole truck fell. Whole thing fell. So many police. Oh a lot of police here. Lot. Whoa. Holy crap. And we saw the pink sign, which is an emergency warning sign. Alright, you guys, give it up for DJ Abby. Alright, ready? You can do it? Okay. Here? Up, up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Come out. Yes. <laughs> I got a minion. Oh, can I get one now? Yeah. To get two. Felix attempting to get two in a row. Two. Those pink ones, but you can't get them because you can't get all the way to the side or the back or the front. They're tricky. I really want dipping dots. Squeeze together. Oh, oh. Ew, you got the ugly one. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna do it too.